Drawing countries from memory full. Okay, it is time to humiliate myself once again. Starting with just countries of Europe, we're going to spin this wheel and I have to draw the country outline of whatever country we land on. Okay, first we have... France, is that? Okay. Alright, here we go. So France isn't too bad to begin with. It's been about 11 months since I last did a Drawing Countries from Memory, purely because I got so much wrong last time that I was just really embarrassed and I just really didn't want to do it again. But I think France is generally just this kind of shape, you know? Is that right? Yeah. Just get rid of this bit at the top. And then really I should include that island. What's it called? Corsica? It might not be Corsica, but yeah, there you go. That is my France. Alright, computer, please reveal the actual French outline. Okay, yeah, I mean, I've generally just simplified it, haven't I? I've got the island in the correct place. All of these points are there, but just obviously in real life, they're a lot more detailed. And there's a few more, like, wiggly bits around here and stuff. I'll tell you what, though, that little island is called Corsica, so I'm quite proud of myself for that one. All right, Eric, can I please give a rating for my first drawing? Okay, a little bit harsh, but that's fine. And now we spin the European wheel again. So I will change this to different continents slash all continents as this video goes on. But to begin with, I want it to be not too hard. Belgium, right. Um, okay. I've got something in mind. Uh, so, oh god. <laughs> this is so tricky, this kind of game. But I think it kind of... It, whoa, whoa. We'll go with it, we'll go with it. Alright, I've kind of run out of space, but that's fine. And then I think it goes in, and then maybe like chunks out of it. No, this isn't looking quite right. I'm already doing it, I'll start again. Okay, I think my first bit was good. Yep, I like that. And then there's definitely a curve like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then it goes in a bit, and then maybe out a bit, and then maybe back out a bit again, like that. Yeah, sure. Oh, do you know what? We'll do the flag as well as a bit of extra fun. Can I get the flag? Now I've put pressure on myself. Is it yellow, red, and black in the middle? Hmm. <laughs> I don't think so. Maybe red and then black at the end. Let's try that. Nope, that don't look right either. <laughs> Black, yellow, red looks correct. All right, let's reveal the actual Belgian outline, and I've drawn it the wrong way. Flip mine, and you'll see that mine suddenly looks much better, okay? Yeah, you see that, yeah? How did I draw it the wrong way, guys? This bit here is definitely too exaggerated, but the overall curve, the bit at the bottom, and this area up here, and even these kind of squiggles, they're quite good. And this bit as well, to be fair. It's literally just this extrusion that throws it off, and the fact that it's the wrong way around. All right, give me my rating, Kai. Okay, I deserve that. Watch how much I faffed on trying to get the colours as by the way. <laughs> okay, one more in Europe, and then we're going to change to a different continent, and I am really going to embarrass myself. All right, what are we going to go with next? And it is Cyprus. Ooh. So I'm familiar with the Cyprus outline because it actually features on the Cyprus flag. Oh, that does not look right already. I'm going to screw this up, by the way. It, I, it does not feel correct. It's something like that. <laughs> No, it's not good, is it? Try again, try again. And then maybe kind of like, maybe I'm doing the point too big. I think I am doing the point too big. All right, like this then. And then we go around. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make it orange. Call it a day. No, I want to do something more detailed. Come on, we can do this. Yes, 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 yes. Go like more wiggly. If in doubt, just make it more wiggly and then it looks better. Yeah, I've got, I think I may have gone too wiggly. I'm not going to lie. Is there more to it? Like, is there like some other spikes? Is it like a fish? Maybe. Let's just colour that in see what happens. Uh, do you know what? We'll lock it in. Why not? Alright, let's see the actual Cypress outline. <sighs> It's not very good, that is it. So interestingly, the little fin that I included is actually there. And obviously we do have the big spike. And then the overall weight distribution is correct, but just this whole area is just totally wrong. And I'm missing a little extrusion down here as well. I said there was more little spiky bits. Yeah, that's not great, that one, is it? Give me me score. Okay, next. Okay, should we try Asia? Oh man, this is going to be absolutely awful. I've already not done great on the Europe ones, so I don't know why I'm expecting to do better on Asia. Oh, what we got? Azerbaijan? I have no idea at all. Yeah, this is literally just a blind guess. I'm gonna just do a, a basic kind of country shape. I'm really not expecting a lot here. Uh, we're gonna get complicated with it because the borders in these areas are always all over the place. We'll do a little exclave as well. Why not? Just shoved over here. Maybe a little one down there. Just have fun with it, Jack. <laughs> okay, a complete blind guess. Were we at all close? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> 
There is an exclave on it, but it's this bit here, and it is quite a lot bigger than mine. Weirdly, this spike that I've got here, I mean, there is a spike in uh, roughly the same area. But yeah, everything else there is completely wrong. Let's just take our no points there, and we'll do the next one. All countries now. Look at that. Isn't it beautiful? If this is anywhere in Oceania, or Asia, or Africa, or even South America for that matter, I'm probably absolutely screwed. Zimbabwe. Oh, God. I think I've drawn Zimbabwe in this series before, and I feel like it did not go well, but uh, I'm pretty sure that Zimbabwe is mostly round, for the most part, with maybe a little bit of a blah blah on the side. Yeah, is that gonna be right? It can't be that simple, can it? Let's go again. We'll wiggle the roundness out a little bit, just like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. We're having fun. We're drawing some wiggles. I'm protruding it a little bit more. Protruding's my new word, by the way, guys, just in case you didn't know. Sure, shall I lock that in? Yeah, why not? All right, actual Zimbabwe outline. I flipped it. I did it the wrong way. <laughs> Flip my drawing and you'll suddenly see it's a little bit closer. <laughs> okay, please rate my flipped version. Okay, and now my original. There we go. That was a quick one, but now we're off again. Where are we going to land on this time? At least we had a basic idea that time, you know? We kind of, we, we were on the right page with it. So next, Eritrea. Oh. <gasps> I don't know. Back to back Africa, one of the smallest African countries. It's so small, I'm not sure I've ever even noticed it on the map. But it's up towards Djibouti and all that area. I think, you know, something's coming to me. I don't think it's as small as Djibouti. I think I was actually thinking of Djibouti there. I think Djibouti's the little fella and Eritrea kind of surrounds it and it's kind of long and thick. Thin, but honestly, I don't know where I'm getting this info from. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm gonna go with. I'm going with that shape right there. We may be completely out. Let's put ourselves out of the misery. Ah! <laughs> so the right thing was in my head, but I forgot this part of it, basically. But I'm actually quite pleased. Look at my little niblet there, by the way. There is actually a niblet on the original that's very similar. And even this bit up here, I've actually got the wiggle. I've missed the exclaves, etc. And also, obviously, I've missed this giant part. Any similarities are pure coincidence, let's be honest. <laughs> right, give me the rating that I deserve. So yeah, whatever. I'm still proud of myself, even if the scores do not represent that. <laughs> right, we're off again, and if I get this one somewhat close, you gotta subscribe, all right? Please, please, thank you. So hopefully it's an easy one. What we got, what we got, what we got, what we got? Uh, Belize, I don't know. It's another one where it's like so small on the map that you don't really notice it. I'm gonna wiggle about. We'll do the classic wiggling about. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. A wiggle, 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 wiggle. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just have a bit of fun with this one. Yep, yeah, that's just basically a complete guess. Let's find out. Belize outline. Yeah, you can't really give me that, can you? If you look hard enough, there's similarities, but nah, I don't deserve anything there. Oh, that means that you don't even have to subscribe as well. That's what's so sad. Well, please subscribe anyway. I'd appreciate that. Samoa? Oh, God. I think Samoa is a singular island as opposed to, like, lots of little ones spread out. It maybe does have some little extra islands, but I think they're all, like, quite nearby it. So what we'll do is we'll just do a general island, and then uh, I'll put some little extrusions on the outside. We're having fun. We're just just getting a bit crazy with this one. This is literally a complete guess. All right, Samoa, reveal yourself. Hmm, no. We need to get our confidence back up. So I'm going back to Europe and we're gonna go again. Give me something I know. Give me something easy. Oh, oh, oh is that Germany? Okay, I can draw Germany. Probably. It's kind of broccoli shaped in my eyes. So we need to have a pointy bit down here because this is where Czechia goes. And then it goes up like, like I said, a piece of broccoli, a big piece of chunky delicious broccoli like that. Mm, I feel I'm over broccoliing it now, I'm not gonna lie. I don't think it's that much like a piece of broccoli. <laughs> I think I've gone too round. I'm gonna have another go. Let's have another go. I do think that this pointy bit here was correct, but then I think I just I just got a bit carried away with the broccoli. So I'm, I'm gonna try and make it less like a piece of broccoli, but still quite a lot like a piece of broccoli. We're gonna go in a bit more. Yeah, yeah. Mm, I like this. I'm gonna lock that in, please. Okay, Germany outline review. Reveal it. Oh, God, it's not really th that cl <laughs> I've kind of really screwed that up. It's definitely not really that much like a piece of broccoli at all, is it? There is this indent here for Czechia, like I said, and then there is a point on the other side as well, but my point's not really very good, and it's in the wrong place, and then the top half's not really correct at all. Oh, let's just get through this. Give me my points, please. Let's do the next one. Dear me. Germany was meant to be my safe bet. That's so sad. Try this yourself. It's a very difficult game. Switzerland. Okay. Switzerland, I can do. I think, anyway. <laughs> I mean, I thought I could do Germany. So, I know 
that the Switzerland country outline is kind of round on the top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's got these like wiggly bits to it like this. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't even know what, what the science behind this is. I'm guessing maybe there's a mountain range or something, but I think it's generally like that. Come on, I need some points. Reveal, Switzerland outline. I've over-exaggerated it. Yeah, I've I mean, I've definitely over-exaggerated it. This game is so hard. I can see why I've not done an episode for a while. <laughs> Oh god, god, I mean, I don't really deserve that many points. There's some key features that are correct, but just give me the points. Undo, undo. Okay, we're spinning again. We're gonna do two more before we end off the video. Uh, Kuribas, oh my god. So Kuribas is a oceanic area, and I think it is one of those that has, like, islands spread out from one another. Well, there's probably a bigger island, and then some, like, surrounding islands. Honestly, I am just kind of winging it, though, other than just drawing some islands. Islands. I reckon there's probably quite a few, so I'm gonna do lots of little circles like this. Oh, that one looks a little bit like a love heart. Oh, that's nice. Uh, I'm doing a, just a general outline. Don't really know what I'm doing. And, uh, oh, that one looks like a bird now. Yeah, that's perfect. That, Jack, that's Kuribas that you've drawn there, I think. All right, let's reveal Kuribas. <laughs> I remember that outline now because I used it on an old thumbnail. But what we've done there is get that completely wrong. Other than maybe the general overarching angle is correct. Everything else is... No, let's be honest. That's zero points. That's a uh -uh noise if I've ever heard one. Time to end off on a high note. I challenge you to play this yourselves, by the way. It's very difficult. France again. Okay, this could be interesting. Let's see if I can nail it. Seeing as I did see the actual answer 29 minutes ago. We start off with drawing a nice detailed Corsica. Now, I remember when I looked at the picture of Corsica, I thought to myself, it's kind of a little bit like Ireland, the way it's all like jaggedy on one side. So there you go. That's a perfect Corsica. And now France. Basically what I did, but a little bit more wiggly waggly. So I think the most easterly point of mainland France, it had like a little nibbler like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we're going inwards, but not too in. Come back out a bit. There we go. Now we go up. We go up. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then down and then back in and then I'm sure that there was like it was something like that on that one side it was that kind of weird I don't know what that is I don't know if it's Andorra or what would it be Andorra yeah I guess it could be Andorra maybe either way I'm gonna continue going in and then I'm gonna go out a bit but not by too much okay yeah 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 uh, wiggle wiggle okay uh, that is our France and Paris is just there very nice <laughs> Do you think we're at all close? Do you think we got a better score than the first time? Let's find out. Let's reveal it. Oh, <laughs> Okay, yeah, we've got our wiglet. I've made the wiglet a bit bigger. This thing on the right is apparently non-existent. I'm probably thinking of Germany, let's be honest. The bottom looks pretty good. Corsica's pretty good as well. But overall, it's still not really that great. <laughs> Guys, recognising country outlines is a lot easier than drawing country outlines. Oh my god. Thanks very much for watching. This is my end score. As you can see, I did really well. And I'll definitely be playing this all the time now. Thanks a lot. I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>